two AI art titans. One showdown. Midjourney versus Leonardo AI. Which one really delivers? On the left, Midjourney, artistic AI imagery on Discord. And on the right, Leonardo AI, a versatile web-based generator. Let's skip the hype, cut through the jargon, and see how these two actually stack up. Each category gets scored, so by the end, you'll know precisely who comes out ahead. The result might just surprise you. Okay, quick roadmap before we get lost in the sauce. Here's what we're gonna compare. Pricing, art style and quality, user interface, customization, features and capabilities, speed and workflow, support and community, and yeah, privacy. Nothing left out, right? Let's jump in. All right, first up, pricing. Midjourney, honestly, it's kind of old school here. You gotta pay right out the gate. There's no free tier to dip your toes in. Their billing's pretty predictable with flat rate plans, but um, the cheapest starts at 10 bucks a month and goes all the way up to $120 if you want the premium stuff. So yeah, it feels a little gatekeepy. Now, Leonardo AI, and okay, this is cool. They actually give you a free plan. You get 150 tokens to play with each day, which is amazing for testing things out or just messing around. Paid plans, also starting at $10 a month, scale up for power users. But unless you're generating a ton of images, you'll probably never hit those limits. Leonardo grabs the win for pricing because honestly, free always feels good. Art style and quality, let's talk about it. Midjourney, I mean, you know the deal. Their images are surreal, vividly artistic, and... I don't know, just have this undeniable wow factor every single time. There's a bit less range in style, but what you do get is kind of next level when it comes to detail and realism. Now, Leonardo AI, it's more versatile for sure. If you want photorealism, abstract stuff, or something in between, Leonardo pumps out really consistent, high quality images across all styles. That said, it sometimes lacks that creative punch or flair you find in Midjourney. So when it comes to pure artistic quality, Midjourney edges ahead. It's the tool for those, wow, how'd you do that moments. Next, the user interface. Midjourney, as you probably know, is all about Discord. If you're totally into Discord and love chatting and sharing prompts, awesome, you're at home. And the community there, super active, great for inspiration. But let's be real, if you're not a Discord user, setting it all up and learning the ropes can feel kinda intimidating. Leonardo AI, meanwhile, goes full web app mode, and I gotta say, it's refreshing. You get a slick dashboard, tutorials baked right in, everything's way more intuitive overall. Plus, no community noise if you just want to generate in peace. Leonardo takes the win here with that user-friendly modern vibe. Hold up, before we go further, let me just say, both platforms let you crank out incredible, unique images almost instantly. Like, you type a prompt and bam, magic happens. All right, customization. With Midjourney, you can engineer some pretty wild prompts, do upscale and variations, but you're mostly limited to what you can type. Not much for fine-tuning, honestly. Now, get this. Leonardo lets you actually train your own models, dial in details with advanced controls, and even work with negative prompts for more precision. They've even got an AI prompt assistant if you get stuck. Downside? It does get technical. But for pure customization, Leonardo runs away with it. For tinkerers and control freaks, you'll love it. Features and capabilities, it's a fun one. Midjourney's tool set, you get advanced upscaling, background removal, object recognition, really neat, sure, but you won't see it handling video or batch jobs, so it's kind of limited there. Leonardo, though, is like, hold my coffee. You can bulk generate up to eight images at once, cut backgrounds out, get transparent PNGs, and, oh, here's the curveball, they have motion and animation plus video generation with Motion 2.0. Early days for their video stuff, but still pretty wild. So yeah, Leonardo's basically the Swiss army knife here. Speed and workflow, let's not forget that. With Midjourney, you'll typically get fast image generation, and it's made for quick iterations. Downside, peak hours can mean you're stuck waiting in a queue, which is a bit of a drag. Leonardo is also fast. Images pop out in like three to 15 seconds, and you can choose between fast and high quality modes. You get private workspaces to keep your stuff organized. Honestly, occasional delays crop up in both. So I'd call this one a tie. Support and community, always important. Midjourney's Discord is buzzing. 
Super active if you want inspiration and those creative collabs. But their customer support, kind of limited. And documentation is just all over the place. Leonardo? It's smaller, but way more structured. Multi-channel customer service, searchable help center, and onboarding guides. Your call if you want a huge, hype-fueled community or just reliable support. For me, this one's honestly a tie. Because some folks want collaboration, others want help fast. And now, privacy. Midjourney honestly drops the ball here. All your images are public by default, unless you manually hide them, which uh, isn't the best for anyone doing professional or branded work. Not ideal, if you ask me. Leonardo, though? All about private workspaces, which is awesome for business, agencies, anyone who cares about keeping stuff under wraps. Clear winner here, Leonardo nails privacy. So, stacking it all up in a radar chart, you'll see Leonardo AI dominates on pricing, interface, customization, features, and privacy. Midjourney shines brightest for pure artistic output and the wild community vibes. Speed and support are neck and neck. No landslides, but some clear leaders depending on what you need. Here's my take. Leonardo AI is just more accessible, customizable, and business friendly, especially because you get a legit free plan and that web interface. Midjourney though, if you want next level jaw dropping art and love collaborating with creators, it's still the go-to. So if you're all about experimenting or working with brands, grab Leonardo. If you want to make art that turns heads every single time, Midjourney's your home. Ready to give AI art a spin? Try Leonardo AI for free and see what you can create. Or jump into Midjourney's artistic wonderland if you crave surreal, legendary images. Go make something epic.